Inside this Manhattan town home, 10 lucky ladies have gathered because they all have one thing in common, their love for one woman. My name is Boop, and I actually hate when people ask me about my real name. That's my name, short and sweet, Boop. Betty Boop, actually, she herself was an icon, and she was black originally, so I take pride in that as well. So, yeah, iconic and classic, that's me. I've had my share of relationships over the past years, for sure. But I've yet to come across someone who, who lasts. So I'm taking 10 women and I'm moving them in the house with me to see if anybody matches my vibe. What's up, it's me, Kay Capri. I'm from Newport News, Virginia. Just moved to New York and I'm a little lonely. So I either want a companionship or a friend. My name is Sarah Hart. I'm here to find love, I mean, I'm a hopeless romantic. My name is Bea Lise. I'm Queens, New York, and uh, I know I'm gonna definitely win this competition. My name is Phaedra Manning, and I'm here to have fun, get to know Boop and everybody else, and compete. Ladies, upon your arrival, you were told to bring a gift for Boop. Either something you think she may like, or an item of personal significance. I see you're all ready with your gifts in hand. Ladies, introducing Boop. She's gorgeous. Boop is beautiful inside out, and honestly, I just hope she sees the same in me. She gorgeous, she bad, I ain't even gonna lie. Like She just has this kind of, this, this confident quality just when you look at her. Welcome to my home. Now, I'm not into material things, but, since I don't know you all very well, I think it would be a good idea to see what you got for me as far as gifts go. And I'm also gonna give you your own assigned name since I'm- I'm impressed by confidence. I don't care. I, I don't have a type. I just prefer a woman who's confident within herself, who enjoys herself alone so that when she meets me, we could just put two and two together. Friendship oh, okay. Everything starts with friendship. Gotcha. All right, duly noted. Your name is going to be Blondie. I was naturally born different. Like, I'm the shit. And I say that in the most humble way. I'm, I'm just the shit. See, you standing to the side. You want me to see that thing. Hello, come on over. Just I see you. Beautiful. Oh my goodness, that was sexy. Um, to Boo, a pen to make your mark. A notebook for all your thoughts. The best poetry book to date. A gift for a true creative. I'm gonna call you creative. All right, all right, for me. I'm really attracted to Boop's creativity. Um, I work with creatives every day in the world of publishing and no one gets me high like Boop's poetry does. Lilies, hydrate, strength pours, calm. Okay, I think I'm gonna call you Serenity. I've been told that Boop's not into white girls, but who's to say? We'll find out, I guess. Hello. I love redheads. Redheads are sexy. I don't know why. I just, I, I find them so, I don't know, spicy. This is how I felt when I saw you. And I wanted to capture it. You weren't. I, I it. genuinely believe that my energy is just not like the energy you see every day. I know I, I stand out. I'm an artist, so, so you know. It's for creativity okay. and strength and courage, which I think you embody. I like hot lips. She putting rings on my fingers, just so you know. Early. Next up, can I get headband? And I was looking for exposure, but now that I know what she looks like, I'm here to win her over, win her heart. This is from my uh, deceased friend's grandma. Uh, she told me when she gave it to me, she was like, go get this to a pretty girl. So when I saw you, I was like, oh, I gotta get it. So, Whoa, I'm gonna call you Ice Drip. I've always been a lesbian. I've always been into women and everything, but I experience things late. I don't get into relationships, I don't do stuff like that, so that separates me from a lot of people. So I had somebody make me a painting of words that I can that describe me. Oh my God. This is beautiful. Thank you. I'm gonna still call you low key though. Thank you. I'm not so big on butches or studs. Been there, done that, got the t-shirt, the keychain, the socks, all of that. So I'm looking for a woman who's more feminine. Um, my dance name is Gold. So this is a little personalized 
thing that will always really? remember. Yep, my dance name is Gold. You dance? I do. I'm gonna call you Goldie. Ah, I like, like that. that? Yes. Okay, good. Thank you. Thank you so much. Amazonite, you're my with the heart. Therefore, I need this. You're able to speak clearly. Thank you. This rules over the mind. I'm gonna call you Wi Fi because we connected quite well. I feel like she'll like me. She'll she'll overlook the whole stud thing. And you look like you just came from the island. I'm gonna call you Island Flame. Thank you, and I told you to pick Really? I can come off as shy at times. Uh, really, really shy. <laughs> kind of given up dating, but I decided to give it one more chance. Um, I'm bi curious, so I've been dating a lot of guys lately and that's just not working out. Okay, okay. You know what they say okay. about Puerto Ricans. You're right, you're right. Okay. And then yeah, I, I, I know a lot about Puerto Ricans. Mm -hmm. What a great in here. It's a homemade acai bowl. <gasps> kind that of smells healthy. so good. You might want to put it in the freezer before you eat it. But. Smells amazing. Thank you so much. Okay. I'm going to call you Boricua. Yes. Thank you. Okay. Um. I think I got everybody, and these gifts are wonderful. What I'm going to do, though, now, since it's hot girl summer and y'all beating hot, is give y'all some time to unwind and just take in the experience and enjoy my house. I'm not nervous about this experience. I'm kind of nervous for them. What I'm expecting, though, is I'm expecting an experience, even if it doesn't go as well or if it goes crazy, I'll be ready for it regardless. What surprised me from other girls in the house is that I am competitive. First of all, I'm a Capricorn and Capricorns are the best. So, I mean, yeah. I naturally just love to be around people and I mean I'm a bartender so I love being around people in general however if I get the time to be alone I like to be alone I'm not leaving honey I'm not leaving I'm not leaving first day I'm knocking three women off off top shouldn't be hard <laughs> <laughs> I'm not here to be friends with any of these bitches. I'm here to win. I'm here for a boop, and they're not. I only got 15 minutes. Let me make it count. This is the cool. Hold on. This is the. This is the cool crowd. These are the cool kids. I don't know the way y'all walked in. It felt like y'all some G shit. Okay. So I have a question. I'm gonna ask everybody this question. It's hot girl summer, right? I wanna know what's the hottest thing you've done this summer so far? I don't really feel like I had it yet. I mean, I went to the Hamptons for the 4th of July and I played Never Have I Ever in the jacuzzi. Somebody Ooh. had to suck my toes. Ooh. Oh, okay. That's pretty really interesting. But that I know what to bring to the table and I know how to appreciate someone. And a lot of people want to be down and they want to do things because it's a good look. I'm not about looks, I'm about vibes. Bisexual, straight, gay, bisexual, that's a problem for me, I mean, I have my qualms with bisexuals. I don't really, well, hopefully things change. I mean, change is good, but not all the time. Good change is good. What about you? I'm cool, I'm lesbian. Colorful, I'm over the rainbow gay. I'm Skittles and Sunshine gay. Pegasus gay. Not unicorn, Pegasus. <laughs> Wings. Full lesbian. Full lesbian? No. How long? <laughs> it's always been years. For real? Yeah. Okay, I'm just saying. I wanna say though, for being a bisexual, my first relationship was with a woman. Was with a woman? How was it? It's beautiful. We're still friends to this day. You like that friend shit. I saw it like, all about friends, that. Your shit. That's how you, you keep them, huh? you can sustain, Well, no, you can sustain a relationship. We may not work out, but if we're good people in the end, at least we have each other in our life at some point. At some point. I feel like that's a sense of pos possession. Just a little bit. Yeah, I like letting go and letting God and 
Let so be. We were friends before we dated, so why would I oh, end my friendship? Okay. Because we dated, then it's kind of like allowing the friendship to take over. The, I mean, uh, the relationship. What's important to, to me over. more than being a lover is being a good friend, and that's something that I pride myself on being a good friend. So, but well, I gotta switch on to the next group. I'm gonna see y'all inside where it's cooler. I can put down now. Next! Hello, hello. Hot lips. Wait, what you got in your hand? Girl, a lot of stuff. Oh, I got a lot going on I right love now. Modelo. Oh, you want to Um, no. Yeah, no. Not yet. I do have my own. Okay, okay. So, ladies, first question. Y'all know what Hot Girl Summer is, right? Have y'all done anything Hot Girl Summer ish as of yet? I went to a, uh, my homegirl's in a BB Dub dance, she's a BB Dub dancer, she goes around, she did like, she danced with Beyonce and all of them. What? She took me to a, a BB Dub pool party in Virginia, so we went out there. It was pretty lit, it was like hundreds of thousands of women and people, it was, it was dope, it was dope. When it was, was this? Three, three weeks ago, it was like did the you? beginning, I know it was like a week after my birthday, my birthday is June 15th, so it was like a week after that. Oh my God. Word. So you're Gemini? Yes ma'am. All right. Okay. I don't have anything nearly that interesting. <laughs> I'm going to win Boop's Heart, hopefully because uh, we both really genuinely want to find someone that connects lesbian. with us. I'm not a cat lesbian. Like, I'm, a, I'm a dog lesbian. No, that's true no, no. because there are, there's a difference. I just like her energy. I could just tell that we would get along really well. Like, we vibe together and she's beautiful. Oh my god, you're tatted up. Y'all got tats? Yes, girl, yeah. I'm tatted. You got tats? Yes, Everybody yeah, got tats? Yeah, yeah. I don't got no tats. But I like it on other bodies. Alright, that's dope. That's I, I, don't like, I, don't, I like women without tats, so that's dope that you don't have any tats. No, real talk. Yeah, okay. No, real talk. For real? My, my ex don't have no tats. Like, I have morals, I guess. And a lot of women I meet don't have those same morals. Or they have this, this weird outlook on life. And I don't have that, because I had a dad and a mom, and they my biological parents, and I just grew up differently. I started drinking at 7 p.m., went to one club eventually with one of my coworkers, had two very large martinis, and then took a cab to go to another club with another one of my coworkers. So you bar hopped and kept drinking all the way into the whole entire way. Did she go home with all your clubs on All of them. Okay, so that's almost a hop. I think what separates me from the okay. other girls in the house is the fact that um, I take my time. And I think that Boop, being in the position that she is, she would really respect that. Almost like kicked the security guard because he told me, he told me that I couldn't be in that section. I was like, well, it's my friend's birthday. You got a time to be here. Be honest. I do, I do, I do. What's your sign? I'm a Capricorn. Oh shit, me too. Just like we gonna skip. We gonna skip. <laughs> I kind of just learned what this hot girl summer thing meant. Um, I'm chill. I didn't really do anything crazy. You think yes. hot girl summer is like a femme thing? Huh? It sounds like a fem thing. Ooh, your eyebrow went up. Okay. <laughs> we gonna investigate that later. <laughs> okay, go deep. You looking all reserved. Like you ain't, you look like you did some hot girl shit. <laughs> Every day is a hot girl day for me. See? Cause I am that hot girl. Okay. But Megan Thee Stallion was supposed to be performing at this club. Yeah. And I'm like her little sister. Cause you know, Stallion. <laughs> And she was taking mad long to like come out. So it's, it was Gemini season at the time. And everybody, this guy was like, whose birthday is it? I said, it's me. I want to get on stage and make it a study. So you went up there? I did. I, I feel like birthday. I am who I am. And whatever perspective you get of me, that's your perspective. I got 10 girls in my house. So I'm expecting some hot shit to go down. <laughs> me or somebody else. I don't know. I don't think it. Probably not. Probably you, Mrs. Ride Till I Can't No More. Ride Till I Can't No More. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so who do you guys think is going to be eliminated first? Nah. I, honestly, I don't even know. I know. I know I'm not. I would be a little upset because Boop is a baddie. Like, at least give me a day or two to talk to her. Just to holler at her and let show, show her where my mind is. You said that I'm saying. No, you mad. You can't pick anybody in here, but you can go with me. You can't You don't I see you still wearing hot lips ring. All right, this is a dope. This is a dope gift. Hot lip stays, not just for the, for the you know, gift, but I like her vibe. She's, She's dope. Nice. I, I like her. Her makeup is, I almost called her Fenty. <laughs> Did you see her shit? Her yes, shit was her, it, her makeup snatched. Was on point. Um, 
And this one. Goldie. You like her? I like her. I like her. But. Uh Uh-oh. Ice dripping? I ain't gonna hold you up. Yeah, she. That wasn't. She said it was somebody grandmama. It was somebody grandmama. That ain't nobody grandmother. I almost didn't believe that. But even if she lied, I feel like the thought was still dope. The, 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 the casing was dope, but it was just like, I couldn't believe it. I'm going to still wear that shit. I ain't going to hold you up. I'm going to still rock that shit. And then um, Island Fling, my island girl, mm-hmm. I have an issue with, smell it. I just rubbed it on me. Can you smell it? Oh, honey, no. You feel me? No. I don't really care for the, mm. and then I didn't really get to really vibe with her, like, I feel like she needs more time to warm up, and I don't got that kind of time. Understandable. <laughs> time is money. Honey. And I feel like, I feel like, I feel fucked up for this, because this shit is not easy. You know what I'm saying? They all came out for me. You know, I want them all to stay. I just feel like everybody's having a good time, but I got to get the chopping. Absolutely. Do you agree with those two? Do you feel like anybody else should go home? At the end of the day, mm-hmm. the decision is yours. You take all the time you need Mm -hmm. to fill these ladies out, and you make the best decision for you. You want some Dunkin' Donuts? Honey, no. I don't, I can't. (laughs) I think it's honestly only space for one blonde here. What's up? I feel like it's a space for one. So we do blondes here, so what you do? What's up, Christina? Oh! So say my name. Ladies, listen up. It's elimination time. Hey. Oh, shit. I guess now we're not. Okay, ladies. So it's been a hell of a night. I've enjoyed myself. But unfortunately, I do have to send some of you home. Originally, it was supposed to be three, but I just couldn't do it. So I'll start with my first person who's not getting eliminated. Uh, couldn't get rid of her ring. So hot lips. Come in, get your heart. You are stunning. And you know you have two names, right? Oh, do I? Yes. Hot Lips and Fenty. <laughs> because your shit is beat to the gods, sweetheart. Do I love Fenty? Yes. Next up, I'm going to bring Goldie. Thank you. So, you are one tall glass of sunshine, sweetheart. <laughs> And I would like to see more of you, and I hope that you enjoy your time with me in the house. If I was eliminated on day one, I would still continue to follow Boo and the rest of the show because she still seems like an interesting person. However, that's not going to happen. Next up is going to be Blondie. I like your vibes, and I look forward to learning more about what makes you tick. Next up, staying in the house, Wi-Fi. <laughs> yeah, I tend to do that sometimes. Come and get your heart. We're getting down. Boricua. Oh, you was in love. You was like, yes, this is it. <laughs> Welcome to my house. Thank you, thank you. Here's your heart. It's getting nervous over there. Uh, low key. Come and get your heart. You leave just enough. Just enough. Because you was going to go home. Because I don't like dogs, but I don't want to start discriminating too tough. If I was sent home on day one, that would mean that it wasn't for me and I was supposed to go home. So if I do get sent home, I'll just go home. I would feel kind of bad, yo, because I don't feel like she'd give me a shot. She'd give me a chance or whatever. So. Um, I would be a little bit disappointed. Can't look at y'all eyes. Um, the next person who is staying with me in the house is Serenity. I saw your face. Yes! And the final person that will be staying with me in my home, I'm gonna go with Creative. Come get your heart. You are a bit of a vixen, but I'm sure there's more to it. 
and I look forward to exploring that. Welcome to my house. Okay, like I said, I didn't want anybody to go home, but you guys hit the bottom too. Doesn't mean that you're any less of a great opportunity for me to meet, but I'm cut for time and I gotta get to the point. So, first of all, Island, I would like you to, to approach the red carpet so I can say my goodbyes. Don't well, swing. she should go home. Who should go home? She should go home. She should go home, she should go home, she should go home, and I should be okay. I came here to win, so what's happening? Everybody came here to win. All right, so she should go home, no, she but should you... go home, she should go home, and I should stay. So I'm going over there, and you're not stopping. You're I'm staying. So you're not stopping. If I gotta sleep in the kitchen, I'ma sleep in the kitchen. So that's your problem. Sis, the doors are gonna be locked. That's not <laughs> my problem. <laughs> it's your problem. Are you going to tell me? Security. First of all, first of all, no, 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 don't first, do that. First of all, let me let you know something. She cannot tell you who is gonna win her heart. Cause all y'all, we all just know. She might not even like all. She might not even like all y'all. So I'm staying. If you have a problem, if you excuse me, oh she definitely does, and that's why I'm staying. But you're leaving. I'm staying. I'm staying. All y'all, all you broke people. I'm staying. I don't want you. She 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 all right, but y'all heard what she said, right? She came here to win. She did not come here to win my heart. That's mm -hmm. different. That's different. When you come to win some shit, that's completely different from winning over somebody's heart. So that's different. So now I will continue. You're so sweet and you have such a beautiful smile. Thank you. And I, I, like I said, I don't want anybody to go home, but. I understand. You got yourself a hot girl summer from what I heard. Not quite, but I understand. So, maybe you should invite me next time. Absolutely, I, left, <laughs> I wrote my number on the gift in just in case you want oh, to. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. Thank you, you so much Thank for you. coming. Oh, boo. So I have a single out, it's called Grinding. You should go listen to it. <laughs> Grinding by Phaedra Manning. In America, go listen to Grinding by Phaedra Manning. That is P-H-A-E-D-R-A-M-A-N-N-I-N-G. Okay? And yeah, I love you guys. Okay, I need a drink after that. <laughs> that was too much. Cover. To the rest of the ladies of the house, welcome and... For the love of boo, cheers. Thinking, baby, tell me what you yes. want. Yeah. Zero to one hundred, that's the switch you want. I'ma change my head and face the mess the chick you want. You better concentrate. I got no time to waste. No other chicks gon' be all up in your face. You better slow your pace. Pick your shades. What do you need, boy? Tell me what it is. Hey. Can I talk to you? Yeah, yeah, come. Have a seat. You said something that uh, kind of made me realize something. Mm -hmm. You said she's here to win, not here to win my heart. And it made me realize um, I don't think that I'm here to win your heart right now. I have a very um, complicated relationship with love, mm -hmm. and I, it may sound, you know, like I'm scared and I'm running away, but I, I didn't think I could handle the responsibility of your heart. You do realize that I sent two willingly people like, home. However, I respect honesty. And as early as you <laughs> have given me honesty, I respect you most out of everybody in this house right now. And that's really hard. And I know this is 
it was probably really hard for you to knock on my door. Thank you for being honest with me. That was really um, profound. As far as women going for what they want, this is a perfect example of it. And that's not just starting or ending with me. There's a lot of women on this show, and I'm pretty sure they're gonna come and bring it. And it's gonna be very exciting, and it's gonna be very eventful, so stay tuned. Dance is my first love, so it's important that you take this seriously and work up a sweat. I feel like you're not here for the right reasons. Yeah, so something doesn't sound right over here, actually. Really not because here. It's like Lots of estrogen. New York girls, you never know what's gonna happen. Mm -mm. We got Queens, Brooklyn, Palm. Find a woman. Everything. What's everything? What's this basketball about? She would be calling who her boo. Here she just saying my shorty. I'm like, you're a shorty. You're a shorty. There's like that's what my shit is. Mad head to here, like your nothing is yours. <laughs> nothing is yours. The only thing that's yours is that ego. Is that ego? Oh, 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 o